Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we're gonna talk about how to make Venn diagrams with Python. A Venn diagram is uh, one of a mathematical concepts to compare two or more uh, uh, different datas. So in this uh, tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can uh, uh, work on Venn diagrams and how you can compare different uh, datas. So, uh, first of all, you, you, you should have to install the matplotlib uh, ven. This is a Python library you can uh, install using pip command. Then once you have installed this, uh, you can import uh, the ven2 and ven3 uh, functions from the matplotlib uh, underscore ven module. And uh, on top of, so this is, uh, uh, visualize on top of matplotlib and you can uh, use plt pyplot uh, to visualize your uh, graph. Okay, once you import to then define a function to make a Venn diagrams, like make a Venn and the function of Venn diagram is our Venn2 on Venn3 and list of data labels that you like to uh, assign to each uh, Venn diagram, uh, then return Venn list and set of levels. Set of levels, uh, this, this is a parameter uh, to set levels for each uh, uh, circle in the Venn diagram. Okay, now let's list out, uh, let's make lists and compare. Uh, genes uh, underscore list one uh, contains list of genes, uh, gene one, gene two, uh, and so on. And genes uh, list to also contains different genes. And I'm going to show you how you can compare using Venn diagram by drawing Venn diagram in Python. So now we call the function make uh, Venn and we pass the arguments. Uh, now we have two lists. So we want to compare two lists. So we use Venn to diagram. Venn to diagram is uh, comparing to, and we pass the list of items as a list of sets. We convert the list, each list into sets and pass a list of uh, the sets as an argument to the uh, function. And we also pass the labels for each uh, circle in the Venn diagram. Uh, for example, we have two uh, uh, lists and uh, we will have two uh, labels, drag A response and drag B response. Then uh, we can put title comparison of drag response. Uh, so automatically, this Venn to function can be uh, the Venn function, and uh, the list of uh, sets is going to be assigned to the function and the labels. Now we, we can uh, let let look at the Venn diagram. This is the comparison of drag responsive genes of gene A, drag A response, and drag B response. So we can see that uh, there are a common elements in both uh, circles. So the common element is six. Uh, there are six elements in uh, common and the drug A response is four, the drug uh, B response is, uh, they have uh, total uh, each have 10 elements, but six are common elements. Uh, this, so we can uh, simply compare uh, the Venn diagram. If you wanna uh, add more, uh, circles in the Venn diagram, you can uh, use, you can also list uh, another list that is containing some genes and you can call that uh, function make Venn and you can use Venn3 function instead of Venn2, not Venn, uh, because we have more than uh, two Venn diagrams. So we can uh, label also three, A, B, and C, and we can see that, uh, the comparison of direct responsive genes, direct A response, direct B response. You can simply identify by colors of each circles in the Venn diagram. Drug C response. Here, as you can see here, uh, there, are, there is overlapping. So you can simply uh, identify the overlapping and uh, uh, the B and uh, A also C is overlapped. So uh, we can uh, simply, uh, uh, let's list another drug and let's look at uh, instead of drug C, we can use drug uh, 
D, drag D, while list of uh, four, and we can see that there, there is no overlapping in this uh, comparison. So this is a simple way to how you can uh, draw a Venn diagram, how, 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 how you can make a Venn diagram using Python and Matplotlib. So this is the best uh, thing to compare two or more things in Python using Venn diagrams. Uh, this is especially for mathematicians and other uh, uh, researchers can use uh, Venn diagrams to compare two or more uh, and to identify uh, the common elements in both uh, data sets. Uh, so like, share, subscribe my YouTube channel and this video also. And uh, I will also share different topics that will help you to improve your uh, knowledge. Thanks for watching today.